hey everyone this video is gonna be interesting here i will break down how you can create interactive framer component and it's open source so you don't have to pay any single of any there you just need to copy and grab that code and generate a new component in framer compatible with framer environment and that's what i'm going to break down so this platform is react bits and i will share the platform link on my description so you can use that so here you will get tons of uh, react components that we are going to convert in framer component and it's really simple so here you don't have to do any complex job just need to click on any component you like and like this one is text type and here you can see the component is playing here so it has also its own property controls and everything that we will generate on our framer component as well so on the right side you can see a code tab you just need to click on it and first you need to copy the cli because uh, it will let our framer workshop to understand what it should generate and which library it should use to uh, generate that so first i am going to paste that here in a notepad you can use any code base as well i'm just pasting everything here and yeah i'm going to sh uh, copy the next one and then this one And you will see there is a um, CSS code as well if it has you have to copy that and if not just skip this and here you just need to give a prompt before start like create a text type animation component based on the given code blah 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 and yeah that's it you just need to copy them all and go back to your framer dashboard and open your workshop and just need to paste that and it will generate that for you but you just need to give it a proper prompt and if you fail to do so from here first you need to generate the uh, raw code in this platform and then i will let you know how you can do that using other ai platform like here you can see it's working and if i change the color of the text you will see it's showing here like see so it's working sometimes it will may not gonna work so what you have to do you can see the workshop already generated the code you just need to click on it and you will get the raw code that is generated so you just need to give another prompt uh if something goes wrong there you just need to mention that using any code platform like grok or cloud code or any gpt platform but i think grok and uh, cloud code or cloud actually works better and also open ai so you can take their help to generate a better component and that's it like that's how you can create any code component following this type of um, ui library based on react or any html based or javascript raw based you can generate anything like well you can also use code pen or similar types of um, react or html css based raw based uh, component platform or any types of interaction you want you just need to organize the code it's it has and then you can give the prompt to your framer uh, workshop and if the workshop fail to do so but you have to gather its first generated code from here and using that code you can let other ai platform to generate that code for you so yeah that's it and if you face any issue you can comment below i will try my best to assist there and yeah that's it have a good time bye